Right, I've done basically everything I could, like side mission wise, it's kind of unimportant to the story on the Citadel apart from this, but I felt that this is just too funny for you not to see, but I'll need the Paragon way anyway, but even then it's still funny. Police have been seen in Al Jalani, Westerland News. Excuse me. I interviewed you two years ago when you first became a Spectre. You presented your case very well on camera. Do you have a minute? What, so you can try to do another smear job on me? Now, Shepard, you may object to my methods, but we're on the same side. Your bat, your news. I just want to give your story its due. Sources claim you were at the heart of the Presidium during the Battle of the Citadel. It's fair to say the course of the battle hinged on your words. If true, you told Admiral Hackett to assist the Destiny Ascension, costing hundreds of human lives, and securing the continued dominance of the Citadel Council. The Turians lost 20 cruisers. Figure each had a crew around 300. The Ascension, the Asari Dreadnought we saved, had a crew of nearly 10,000. But surely the human cost. The Alliance lost eight cruisers. Chen Yang, Emden, Jakarta, Cairo, Seoul, Cape Town, Warsaw, Madrid. And yes, I remembered them all. Everyone in the Fifth Fleet is a hero. The Alliance owes them all medals. The Council owes them a lot more than that. And so do you. <laughs> Commander Shepard, first human Spectre. Hero of the Battle of the Citadel. Check bid. We get it? Great. Bull rushed on my own show. Lol. Right, that's just done then. <laughs> right, we'll go back to the... Welcome. Uh, I don't care. Hero. Thank you for using a view. Um, we'll go back to credits, the... We offer data protection the Normandy. Do a mission now. <laughs> back to the action. Skip. <laughs> um, but yeah, guys. If like I said, this part will be up immediately if the last part did well. But if it didn't, if this part gets four likes within two hours, then I'll upload the next part. Keep uploading, need to keep the consistency up. Um, now that I'm exam free, I have the time to keep the consistency up. Mass Effect 2 is going to be much, it's going to be done immediately, like, the pace I'm going at now. And then we'll be able to do Mass Effect 3 as well, anything else. Right, journal, I wish we do. I feel like doing another dossier mission, the Convict. Imagine being in a prison called Purgatory. That's kind of bad. <laughs> ah well. I don't actually know where the like Purgatory comes from. I know it's like in between hell and heaven, but I don't think it's ever mentioned in the Bible. Someone created Purgatory though. Obviously made it up, but cool to know who. This purgatory is cool. My platoon. That crew. That CGI. I need to customize my armor soon. 
give some variety. Welcome to the Purgatory, Shepard. Your package is being prepped and you can claim it shortly. As this is a high security vessel, you need to relinquish your weapons before we proceed. I can't do that. Everyone stand down. Commander, I'm Warden Kirill, and this is my ship. Your weapons will be returned on the way out. You must realize this is just a standard procedure. It's my standard procedure to keep my gun. Let them proceed. Our facility is more than secure enough to handle three armed guests. We're bringing Jack out of cryo. As soon as the fund's clear, you can be on your way. If you'll follow me to out-processing for the pickup, Commander. Let's go. Cell Block 2. As you can see, we keep tight control over the population. Each prisoner's cell is a self-contained modular unit. I've blown a few out the airlocks as an example. The ship is made up of 30 cell blocks identical to this one. We house thousands of criminals. We can put the whole place in lockdown on a moment's notice. Nothing goes wrong here. Can you tell me about Jack? Cerberus hasn't told you. Jack is the meanest handful of violence and hate I've ever encountered. Dangerous, crazy, and very powerful. You'll see soon enough. How'd you end up running this ship? I was in law enforcement on Palavin and got sick of seeing criminals escape out into the galaxy to carry on with their crimes. Bounty hunters aren't dependable. Eventually, I hit upon this idea. Keep the criminals in space, and the galaxy is a safer place. You do this because you think it's necessary? Every day I see the worst sapient life has to offer. Governments are soft, unwilling to make the hard choices. Someone had to stand up and make the galaxy safe. Maintaining a population this size in space can't be cheap. We can cut corners that governments can't, and each prisoner brings in a fee from his home world. These individuals are violent, and their home planets pay well to keep them here. What happens if the home world doesn't want to pay? We explain that we can't maintain the prisoner without their help, so we'll be forced to release him back onto his home world, at an unspecified place and time. So it's an extortion racket? You don't have to agree with my methods, but don't question my motives. These are despicable people, and I'm keeping them locked up. Let's get on with this. Have there been escape attempts? We're in space. They have nowhere to go, and they know it. But still, we exercise extreme caution. These are dangerous individuals. We have many ways to control the population. I'm going to confirm that the funds from Cerberus cleared. Our processing is straight down this hallway. Just keep going past the interrogation rooms and the Supermax wing. I'll catch up with you later, Shepard. It seems very harsh. But you know how that thing that split up the two prisoners? If only modern new technology was like that, it'd be much easier. You don't even get good information that way. After a point, victims admit to anything to make the pain stop. Is there something I can do for you? There's no excuse for beating a prisoner who can't fight back. This is a massage compared to what his victims went through. This degrades you as much as him. We have orders. You're not important enough to make your own decisions? I admit, I sometimes get tired of this. Does this really get us anything useful? Stop this. For your own sake. Yeah, you're right. Call it off. At least for now. There we go, Shepard. Hey! Good. Hey, if you're buying prisoners, can you buy me? Man, I, I don't care where you take me or what you do to me. It's gotta be better than this. We're here for Jack. Jack? Forget what I just said. I don't want to go nowhere with you. Tell me more about Jack. The worst trouble you ever saw. Mixed with some crazy and way too much biotic power. That's all I'm saying. I thought this ship was a prison, not a market. Sometimes people buy cons so they can do some punishing of their own, if you understand. Warden sells this to whoever can pay enough. Why are they interrogating that prisoner? He knows something? Nah, that's Bimmy. He don't know nothing. He offed someone in the showers yesterday, I think. 
Guy he killed was worth a lot to the warden. Yeah, sucks to be Bimmy right now. They're going at it pretty hard. Do they ever kill prisoners by accident? I haven't heard of anyone dying. Warden can't make money off us if we're dead. Funny thing, though. The more a guard does it, the meaner he gets. So they rotate him through. They're going at it pretty hard. I haven't heard of anyone... Funny thing, though. The more a guard so, does it... So, what are you in for? I killed a few people. Only about 20 or so. And I blew up that one habitat. Small time compared to most of the guys here. Jesus. Oh, I'm just a studio killer. I blew up a hole and knowledge. Okay. What's it like here? Bad. And you gotta watch out. Damn, but someone's always after your stuff. Your smokes, your clothes, your pride. I haven't taken a shower in three months. Oh, Jesus. He's talking about rapists. I should go. Wish I could go. I hear the screaming in my head. It's nice. Yeah. Camp there, Vegas. Now processing through the door on the far side of the room. Coco. My apologies, Shepard. You're more valuable as a prisoner than a customer. Drop your weapons and proceed into this open cell. You will not be harmed. Maybe I can change your mind. Activate systems. Well, so much for that. What a shot. You get screwed over in a corrupt prison. Shot shank is dead. It's taught me a lot of things. Hack that control, every door on the cell block opens. It's the only way to get Jack out of cryo. I'm doing it. Be ready. Subtlety. Huh. 
I thought that would be some cast. We want to show die as well. Insanity for some advice. Just use cover a lot when you're doing it and use whatever weapon you have best. Or on whatever um, class that you prefer. But being a soldier is really helpful, I think, with it. Oh, no explosion. Oh, there, there is. Shotgun. This guard got swarmed by prisoners with improvised weapons. He never had a chance. That Turian just kind of lost the ball. This is the first time I've ever had, had to go back the way in normal. It's because it's just cover here. So you have to use it on the side. This should oh, slow him down. That's much easier. Damn it. 
pressed B accidentally. You're valuable, Shepard. I could have sold you and lived like a king. But you're too much trouble. At least I can recapture Jack. Not happening. You're a two-bit slave trader, and I don't have time for it. I do the hard things civil governments are unwilling to. This is for the good of the galaxy. No, I see. You're insane. Engaging hostiles. Here we go. That one hit. That's one good thing, but then Mark Rose there's a lot of cover that just pops up. Oh, but that isn't good. Damn it! Oh, I hate that when that happens, when you just die randomly. That was my fault. Sorry about that, guys. Just having to cut through this loading screen. We're waiting. We're waiting. We're waiting. Blah blah blah. I'm going in! Taking cover! Here we go! Death is the boss shield. do you want? You're in a bad situation and I'm gonna get you out of here. Shit, you sound like a pussy. I'm not going anywhere with you. You're Cerberus. Why does it matter if I'm with Cerberus? They've been on my ass for years. Anytime I get free, they put a huge bounty on me. That's why Warden Curel figured he'd struck gold when he caught me. She's destroyed Cerberus property and killed Cerberus people. Hence the bounty. You die first. <laughs> oh, she, immediately she doesn't like her, okay? I'm here to ask for your help. You show up in a Cerberus frigate to take me away somewhere? You think I'm stupid? This ship is going down in flames. 
We can get you to safety, and we're asking for your help. We could just knock her out and take her. I'd like to see you try. We're not gonna attack her. Good move. Look, you want me to come with you? Make it worth my while. Join my team, and I'll do what I can for you. Don't make promises you can't keep. I bet your ship's got lots of Cerberus databases. I want to look at those files, see what Cerberus has got on me. You want me on your team? Let me go through those databases. I'll give you full access. Shepard, you're not authorized to do that. Oh, it upsets the cheerleader. Even better. You better be straight up with me. So why the hell are we standing here? Move up. Job well done. Welcome to the Normandy, Jack. I'm Miranda, Shepard's second in command. On this ship, we follow orders. Tell the Cerberus cheerleader to back off, Shepard. I'm here because of our deal. Miranda will let you into the system. Let me know what you find. Hear that, precious? We're going to be friends. You, me, and every embarrassing little secret. I'll be reading down in the hold, or somewhere near the bottom. I don't like a lot of through traffic. Keep your people off me. Better that way. Hmm. Well, guys, I will see you next part. Just remember to hit a like if you liked the video, and uh, you'll get more parts immediately. Uh, thank you guys for watching and listening.